Hey what's up everybody, today I'm going to show you how to make a simple modding program for games like Call of Duty World at War and Modern Warfare 2. This program is going to mod the save game files and um, it's going to do that by writing to certain offsets and change the writing. Now let's go ahead and open up your Visual Basic, create a new project, name it whatever you like, I'm going to keep it the same. Uh, go to the toolbox and drag and drop two buttons. Let's just make this look a little decent. Alright, now click button one, name it to CMD open. and then make the text open then go to the toolbox and drag and drop open file dialog onto the open button then rename open file dialog 1 to OFD1 then make the file name blank then click button 2 rename it to CMD mod then make the text mod then right click on the form go to view code delete this then go to the description of the video and you'll see this coding copy it and then paste it into the form one coding. Two things you need to know. FS position equals and H zero is what you're writing to. Now let's say you need to write to offset one hundred. You make this line here FS dot position space equals space and H one hundred. You have to leave and H there or else this won't work. So I'm going to write to offset 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. Then the other thing you need to know is the writer dot write. Between these quotations is what you're going to be writing. So when I show you that this program works, it's going to write DG modding tutorial how to make a simple modding program. That's when it's going to put in the file. But if you guys forget, I put it in the coding, as you can see. Don't worry about it being there. It's not going to affect anything. It's basically notes. So I'm going to show you guys that it works. As you can see, there's nothing inside this test file. No. Let's do this. Open. Test. Mod. Scroll down. There you go. All done. Um, I'm going to be making a lot more Visual Basic programs, tutorials. Um, here's a little preview to the new DG mod. I added another thing called Xbox 360 ISO tools. Phenom Snipes gave me the idea. So I added Image Burn, ABGX 360. WX360 and FF Viewer. Well, that's about it for today, guys. If you have any questions, send me a message, leave a comment, and um, thumbs up, please. Well, till next time, guys.